Hi kids, my name is Joycey Horsey. Are you ready to read with me? Yes, yes, yep, yep, yes! Yep, 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 yep. Okay, let's go! Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe! Today we are going to read the book, My Cat's Secret. Are you ready? Let's begin! Sarah was a girl who loved cats. She loved big cats and little cats. She loved long-haired fluffy cats and short-haired silky cats. She loved black cats with yellow eyes and gray cats with blue eyes. But Sarah did not have a cat. Pets were not allowed where she lived. Then one day, Sarah's mom and dad had exciting news. We're moving, mom said. You will have your own room and a yard to play in. Can I have a cat? asked Sarah. Dad smiled. Wait and see, he said. Two weeks later, Sarah moved into her new house. While mom and dad unpacked the boxes, Sarah sorted out her bedroom. Then she went downstairs. There was a box on the kitchen floor. It had holes in one end and a handle on the top. Open it, said dad with a smile. Sarah bent down and opened the box. Inside was a lovely little cat. Her fur was stripy and soft. Her name is Tabby, said Dad. She belonged to the people who lived here before us. Can we keep her? asked Sarah. Of course, said Dad. Tabby had two bowls. One was for her food and the other one was for her water. She needs to eat once a day, said Mom. She also needs fresh water in her bowl. Mom put a new cat flap in the back door. Now Tabby could go outside whenever she wanted. The next day, Mom and Sarah took Tabby to the vet. The vet looked in Tabby's ears. Then she felt the cat's tummy. Is something wrong with Tabby? Sarah asked. The vet shook her head. Don't worry, she said. Your cat is very healthy. All cats should have a checkup from time to time, said mom. All summer long, Sarah and Tabby played together. On sunny days, they played in the yard. On rainy days, Sarah made balls out of yarn and Tabby chased after them. But Sarah and Tabby were not always together. Sometimes, Sarah liked to play with her friends. Tabby liked to go out and play with her friends too. One night, Sarah had a bad dream. I dreamed that Tabby got stuck in a hole, said Sarah. Cats are very careful, Mom said gently. If their whiskers touch the sides of a space, they won't crawl in. One day, Sarah noticed that Tabby was getting fatter. She was always lying down too. Sarah tickled Tabby's ears, and the cat purred and blinked her eyes. It was as if she had a secret she was keeping to herself. On Sarah's birthday, Mom made her a special birthday cake in the shape of a cat. Dad gave Sarah a necklace with a cat on it. Oh, thank you, Sarah cried. I must show Tabby. Mom and Sarah looked and looked for Tabby. They looked in her favorite chair and in her cat basket. Then they looked in the yard. They could not find her anywhere. 
I have a cat necklace and a cat cake, Sarah cried. But no cat! Tabby has gone! At that moment, Dad rushed into the kitchen. Follow me, he cried. I have a surprise for you. Have you found Tabby? asked Sarah. You'll see, cried Dad. Look in your bedroom. Sarah ran up the stairs and raced into her bedroom. The bottom drawer was open. Tabby was inside. Two tiny kittens were curled up beside her. Tabby looked up and blinked. Happy birthday, she seemed to say. Sarah looked down at the kittens. They were the most perfect presents ever. The End Hi kids, my name is Cookie Cow. See you next time. Bye.